it's your boy DC Chase here welcome back to my channel today we're playing the wolf among us and we're continuing we're going to play episode 2 part 1 of smoke and mirrors I know that some of you guys are waiting for another Batman episode and another walking dead episode I'm just taking a pause on those games and just finish one at a time I'm gonna finish one first then I will go back to it because it was unorganized and it was hard to balance with all of that said guys let's go to the chase Mr. Toad do something Big B before he completely tears up the place whoa 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 hey hey you've got something on your face Fuck are you talking about, you stupid cur- You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Look, whatever it is, it's between you and Beast. I'm staying out of it. It's not what you might be thinking. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Nope. Haven't seen her. Come with me. No. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow! You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. <laughs> no, I'm D. He's dumb. <gasps> but he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. Holly, you're out of paper towels and the... Uh, they're gonna string me up, Bigby. Like you said, it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. All right, I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that could tell me something about a girl named... Fuck, man! This fucking lab dog. He comes sniffing around this part of town. Rich fucks in the woodlands need a shake to her. Isn't that right, Big B? Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Making this more difficult than it has to be. Wait, I'm being interrogated? If you just cooperate and answer the questions, you can go home. Maybe get some sleep. How are you feeling? I know it's been a long night for you. You look like you could use some rest. I'm being interrogated. This nice. is ridiculous. Look. I know what you must be going through. Really, I do. But I could use your cooperation. That's very helpful. Thank you. Who are you gonna write down I'm smoking? I'm being interrogated, bro. That just don't make any sense. What? You stressed out? Ah, uh, wait, Mom. I'm Detective Brannigan. What? Please. Please. What's 
wrong with this guy? I'm sorry. Just make it stop, please. How the hell went on, Doc? Y'all taking some mad pills, bro. <laughs> what was that? We have to go now. What the hell? What the fuck is going on? You should be thanking me. It's just a memory wipe spell. Very expensive, but it works. The whole station will forget the last 24 hours and everything they saw at the woodlands. Well, hurry up. Duh, that's a shady dog. <laughs> Yo. Well, I didn't say anything anyways. Yeah, they don't need that. Yeah, we need to, like... I don't even know, bro. I'm lost. <laughs> yeah, this dude has some questions to answer, yo. Is a coughing session? Thanks for the lift. Certainly. We um we found Tweedledee chained up to a post. That was your doing, correct? Yeah. Well, I don't know why you detained him. D was at the trip trap when Snow was left at the woodlands, so he couldn't possibly be involved in this mayhem. Why are you covering Blue for Bluebeard's him? Bluebeard's currently interrogating him. And he hasn't said oh. anything useful. And uh, Big B, we have to tread carefully here. He's working for somebody. And whoever it is wants him snooping around every crime scene I've looked at. That doesn't necessarily mean they're involved in the murders. been one full night and a slice of morning and I already miss her too yeah you've been cussing her out making her job harder you should feel guilty you know, I never get more homes than when one of us dies and now were it to be snow I've never been good with these sorts of things I just can't believe this is really happening dwelling on this shit isn't helping well, I apologize if my attempt at handling this has disturbed you, Bigby. But I thought we had some common ground. All right. It's been a shitty couple of days. I know you're trying. Thank you. I don't know why I'm asking you, but did she give any indication as to what she was thinking? When you saw her last, I mean. I don't know why, but I'd like to know that she was... I guess fine, I suppose. Yeah, Bro, she was frustrated. She gave an indication she was pissed at you. By saying that she was pissed at you. At me? She was frustrated with the whole fucking system. Tired of having to turn fables away. It wore her down. I don't know what else to say, Bigby. We have to have to put an end to this. It's been two murders in as many days. If we don't unearth our culprit, and soon there will likely be another on our doorstep tonight. I'll get it done. Please, Bigby, for Miss White. I got it. <laughs> Ready to check your glass. That's not a very good answer, is it? Come on. Torture! Just tell me what I want to know. It will make things a lot less painful for you. In theory. Oh, were you planning on using that? I just thought you really liked rubbing your little sword. <laughs> what the hell do you think you're doing? Hello, Ichabod. Sheriff. Bluebeard. I was just chatting with our new friend. 
You were supposed to wait for us to get back. I told you, if you want to be involved, you will do things my way. No violence! Whatever you say, Ichabod. Hello, Big B. I want answers, D. Oh, goody. I thought you wanted questions, and I was having so much trouble thinking of any good ones. Though I'd settled on, how's your head? You see what I've been dealing with? What are you going to do about this, Bigby? I'm glad you have a sense of humor. I hope that means you're willing to cooperate. Snow White is dead. Look, I didn't kill anyone. And I'm supposed to just believe you. You were with me when it happened, dummy. I still have questions for you, D. Sounds like a personal problem. This is ridiculous. Let him work. He's got more experience with these kinds of things. Why were you at Toad's place? Mm -hmm. Looking for a change of scenery. Thought I might move in. Had to take a look around first, of course. Make sure everything's up to code and whatnot. Yeah. Looked all right. Okay. Except for this big hole in the wall. Mm -hmm. Might get drafty. All right, D. Let's get to know each other. Let's see if you got some more words to say. Oh boy. Check this out, bro. Fuck, Big B. Don't make me look at that. Just put that away. Please. Snow was murdered, D. She was important to me. If you know who did this, you have to tell me. I don't know what to tell you. You're barking up the wrong tree. I don't know who did it. You're not a tree, you're a stump. Just tell me what you were doing at Toad's place. Look, Bigby, we're not on opposite sides here. My brother and I are trying to get to the bottom of things. Same as you. Your brother? Where was he last night? I can't say. He could have been anywhere. Mm -hmm. Take your best guess. He didn't do it, if that's what you're thinking. Then where is he? No, I'm not sending you after my brother. Look, I answered your question. Can I get my stuff back now? What did you find on him? Oh, uh, nothing of consequence, really. Nothing of consequence. This is getting old very quickly. You always carry this much cash. I've got a lot of laundry to do this week. What's it to you? I better get that back. <sighs> tax man. I'm declaring a tax on uncooperative <laughs> I said it. <laughs> You taken out a loan? You might not like the interest on that. You'll need to account for that. You can't just shut your ass. There are off. procedures to be followed. Procedures what? We'll talk about it this later. This dude is in the base. So where's your brother? Look, mate, I'd like to help. I would, but I can't tell you where he is. Last time I saw him, we split up, and I went to find Faith. I don't know where he is now, but he didn't what kill was anybody. That about Faith? You mentioned Faith. Look. I went to her apartment. That's no secret. You saw me. No, there's more to it. You said you were trying to find something. Ooh. All right, D. What did you want from Faith? Sorry, I can't help you. I'm not saying any more about it. <sighs> it's moving along. I'm saving that. <laughs> this is really... What's the point of this? Ugh, fuck! Stop, you fucker! Let's talk, let's talk. Like, <gasps> let's talk like so, human beings. This is how it's gonna be. What are you doing? Getting answers. I told you to keep yourself under control. Uh, let me handle this. 
What did you want from Faith? I didn't want shit from that little thief! More trouble than she's worth. I could say the same about you. Oh yeah? Untie me and see how much trouble I am! What did she steal? Must have been valuable. I don't know! It was just some dumb thing my boss was after! What did you say? Your boss? Mm-hmm. So let's talk about your boss, then. Come on, D. It's clear you're just following orders. So who's calling the shots? No! I'm fucking done! This is bullshit! Let me go! Let's have a drink. You just carry this around? It ain't illegal, is it? I'm not playing with you anymore, dog. What the fuck? Big B, you shit! Last chance, Steve. Who are you working for? Fuck you! You're a piece of shit, Big B. Beauty was wrong about you. You're just a sick beauty. You're full of shit. Oh, we're good friends. That's enough. I will not tolerate this savagery. Yo, you think up. someone was trying to kill Snow? Isn't it more likely someone was trying to get back at you by killing her? You want to talk about Snow? You treated her like shit your whole career. Better take the blame for your incompetence. Now you can. What's going on down here? What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Y'all messed up for that. Y'all messed up. That. That, I'm just trying to get this dude to talk. Oh my goodness. What the hell was going on down there, Bigby? Abusing a prisoner like that. I thought you could control yourself. I thought you were dead, Snow. And that makes it okay? Alright, I got nothing to say. I got nothing to say. I hope it was worth your time. Oh my god. Where the hell have you been all night, Snow? I was working on this case. After our conversation in the taxi last night, I got a call from Toad. He said his son found a body. We thought it was Faith at the time. Getting her back here wasn't easy. But hopefully we'll find something on her to help us track down the killer. Or at least to figure out who she is. I should have been there, Snow. I tried calling the business office, but there was no answer. I couldn't find you. Or anyone. So I took care of it. Okay, Miss Independent. Snow? What is it? I guess... I'm glad you're... Uh, not dead. Me too. I just want to get to the bottom of it. Did you just say me too? You should have just... Like... Let somebody just... find me, dog. You knew I was going to I the just... bar. I feel... Responsible, in a way. She looked just like me. And maybe that's why she was killed. You need to be careful. If someone wants you dead, at some point they'll realize they missed their target. And they'll come looking for me. We just have to find out who did this. And why she was glamoured to look like me. I mean, that's what it is, right? So, what's our next move? You should... Maybe you should lie low for a while? Until we figure out what's going on. And what? Sit around the business office twiddling my thumbs, waiting for the big bad wolf to solve all my problems? That's wow. not what I meant. Well then what did you mean? I told you, I'm tired of sitting around. I'm not going to be an errand girl for Crane anymore. I just want you to be careful. I almost lost you once. I'm and... not yours to lose. Oof. Damn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Whoa. I'm sorry. Where is that energy for Crane? Crane is the one that. I know that... it's dangerous, but I'm not helpless. Damn. I can take care of myself. I've been doing it for centuries. Alright, I'll just leave you guys. DJ to is it. waiting inside. He was so freaked out last night, he wouldn't tell us much. 
Even now, he just stops talking altogether after a certain point. He's pretty shaken up, though, so try not to be too... you know. Myself. Myself. Right. Damn, dog. TJ's over there. I don't know if you want to talk to him first or after, but let me know when you're ready to see the body. I... I want to be there. Buffkin, do you have a second? Of course, Miss Snow. <sighs> Had all the energy for me, but not for Crane. Yeah, something else, dog. That's appropriate. I don't know what these tarot cards mean. The moon. Usually this is about deception or confusion. But yeah. for me? Well, who knows? I'm hella confused right now. I hope you can find what you're looking for. What's this? An acids. Maybe this has been harder on him than I thought. What's that? Yeah. Alright, uh, I think I went too far with the whole interrogation. Snow's perfume. Yeah, I went too far. But knowing how D is that dude won't cooperate for shit dog like we just didn't have any time to like I agree we don't have time to waste but I'm getting heat but what are y'all doing oh that's enough Mira finish cancel no. what the hell are you doing don't even get started with me sheriff What's going on? I saw what you did down there. Is that how you treat your prisoners? I'd be lying if I said I didn't want to give Tweedledee a good smack after what he put me through. But what you did to him was way over the bloody line. You scared the shit out of me, little boy. He saw everything! Because he went to the fucking okay, mirror. Okay, Mr. Toad. No! I want an explanation. And what did you expect to see? I thought maybe I'd catch you on the shitter. But I saw something worse, didn't I? Yeah, some That's dumbass enough. dog. I... <laughs> yeah, fool. Mr. Dog. Toad, I deeply regret the distress this has caused you and your son. But right now, we need to carry on with the investigation. Wait, you don't have, have TV to speak at your you house? About your concerns later, but you must understand how urgent this is. You carrying around your kid to spy on a cop? Yeah, some damn fool. This dog. ain't over, Big B. But what do I expect from a frog? Get out of my face, man. TJ. It's all right. Are you ready to talk to Mr. Wolf? Watch yourself, Big B. You do anything to hurt me, boy. Yo, shut the fuck up, Doc. Like, honestly. It's okay. Just start from the beginning. Go ahead. D was the one that came and robbed your house. I was swimming at night sometimes, in the river. I wasn't doing anything bad, I promise. Of course you weren't. We know you're a good kid, TJ. You're okay. You're not in trouble. Just tell me what happened. I was there, under the big blocks, and I heard noisy feet. And when I hear that, I'm supposed to go underwater and stay real still and quiet. That's right, son. Wait, that's Clem's voice. Then I saw... I... I saw the lady! <laughs> it's okay, son. 
Take your time. The lady fell in, but but she didn't have her head on. I thought I, I thought she was gonna pull me down too. <laughs> cause cause she had rocks on her feet and she kept falling down in the dark parts. <laughs> oh man. Cinder blocks tied to her ankles. Is there more, TJ? Is it true? You know when people are lying? I heard you could do that. That's why you're the sheriff. Yeah, part of my job is being able to tell when people are lying. I'm really good at it. Is there something else you want to say? Please, don't be mad. What is it, TJ? I... I didn't stay under the water. What? I know I'm supposed to, but I was scared, and, and I went to the top again. I couldn't help it. I gave you very specific rules. You have to stay quiet and out of sight no, of bad so things up. can happen. I told you. Leave him alone, Toad. He's my son. I've set boundaries for a reason. This is a special circumstance. Leave him alone. He set boundaries and he have spine on the, the, the detective dog. So Shut you didn't up. stand or water. I don't know if anyone saw me, but but someone said, stop laughing. And then I was scared, and I went under for as long as I could. Wait, you heard someone? Yes. Why didn't you tell us before? I didn't want to be in trouble. Pigby. Well, I missed that. I missed... Oh, sure, I missed Thank that. you, TJ. Okay, son. You did a good job, kid. Come on, then. Take a kid home, man. At least that's a responsible thing that you can't do for the first time. That went about as well as I expected. <laughs> I don't want to hear it from you, either. You want to go look at the body now? Uh, in a minute. In a minute. When you're ready. Hello, Big B. Nice to see you. Freaking Tattletail. What were you showing Mr. Toad and his son? Cinderella selling shoes, Rapunzel, Rose, and of course there's you. And I can't help note that you did not rhyme. Do try to stick to the rules next time. Yeah, I'll do that. Trying for a rap career or something. Should break this glass. Alright. Alright, let's not waste any time. So, check out anyone who fits that profile. You might start with Bluebeard. Right away, Miss Snow. Are you ready to examine the body now? Yes, madame. Yeah. Oh my goodness! I almost forgot. Come on. Getting heat from a frog. before you go and you'll be a bunch of